Dr. Zhao, do you have everything you need for the presentation? Yes, Asha. Who is attending from the trifecta? Today you will be meeting with Seraphine Voss, commander of the Imperial Forces, Zarek, High Custodian of the Vault, and the Viscountess, Sovereign Empress of the Celestial Dominion. Thank you, Asha. Please ensure the qubits remain stable during the demo, especially when we run the complex entanglement sequences. Any decoherence could cause the AI's predictive algorithms to return incomplete data sets, which we can't afford to happen at Sand Hill Highway. Dr. Zhao, welcome to the Sand Hill Highway Palace. We received your message and thought it prudent to meet and learn more about your new project. Please proceed. Zarek, Viscountess, and Commander Voss. What I'm about to show you is a revolutionary investment opportunity. I've created a truth machine, but it doesn't just tell you the truth. It shows it to you. And what do you call this so-called truth machine, Dr. Zhao? Our technology is embedded in our system of perception. You interact with it by looking and listening through your own eyes and ears. It uses generative AI, capable of creating any image or sound, with augmented reality, to transform what people see and hear. Shows us the truth? <gasps> you make an ambitious claim, Dr. Zhao. How does this machine of yours work? The machine integrates the entire body of human knowledge, making it accessible, digestible. What you see, Viscountess, is the embodiment of history, an augmented experience that reflects the closest approximation to reality we can achieve. And what does this machine decide to show us, Dr. Zhao? History, you say. But whose history? Which version of events? The algorithm identifies and displays the most relevant information from all known sources, simplifying the vast complexity of human experience into something understandable. It harnesses humanity's collective knowledge, explaining what you're seeing, anticipating future events by analyzing patterns like bird movements, signaling rain, fewer cars indicating an economic slowdown. But I am not just dealing with abstract philosophical questions. I am trying to solve real-world problems for people in real time whose lives may depend on what they see. Let's explore a simple example, or you might simply want to understand your living room. What information is most salient to you right now? You might want to know the temperature or have augment or detect issues with the plumbing or heating. It can even pull historical data showing your room in the 1970s or how it might look in 2070. It could predict the room's state in rising sea levels or an earthquake. As new data emerges, the machine evolves but our aim remains the same, to provide maximum perception, the clearest, most accurate representation of reality. Accurate according to whom? We all know that history is written by the victors, Dr. Zhao. What happens when your machine encounters contradictions or when facts change? The machine does not claim finality. Truth, as you know, is not always a fixed point but a process, a continual unveiling. When new facts are discovered, they are integrated. The machine adapts, revises its understanding. What we provide is the best possible representation at any given moment, a reflection of the most probable outcome. Dr. Zhao, we would like to purchase the nature of truth. Are you able to sell that to us? If we own that, then nothing else matters. Viscountess, we are still a long way away from understanding the nature of truth. The best we can provide now is the most probable outcome. How the world works is still a mystery from an engineering perspective. We are not even sure how we are able to know the world, but mathematics has evolved, and we are now better at recognizing patterns using these models to anticipate what comes next. That is the closest thing we have to understanding the nature of truth. 
then we would like to purchase the algorithm. We would like to know the future, even if we don't know how we were able to predict it. Viscountess, knowing the future may offer power, but it will also bring unforeseen burdens. Once the truth is revealed, it cannot be ignored. This is no ordinary investment. It's a leap into the unknown. Dr. Zhao, power always comes with burdens. And those of us who bear them understand that it is better to see, to know, than to be blind. We will wield the truth, and if it shifts beneath our feet, we will adapt. We are not afraid of the unknown. We are not afraid of the future. We are the ones who shape it. <laughs>